in this video, we find out the result of the MOT test for Project Escort. Is it a pass or is it a fail? Let's jump inside the car and get out of the cold and I'll tell you the result. Hello and welcome to Scottish Car Enthusiasts and Trains TV. And in this video, we find out if it was a pass or a fail for the Escort on its MOT test. I'm about to reveal the result now. It was a pass. The car went into um, Farmers Auto Care on Saturday and we dropped it off about oh, about 10 to 8 in the morning. We had the MOT result back by 9 o'clock in the morning. It was a pass with um, two advisories. Um, one advisory being the back left uh, and the inside of the tyre was starting to perish. Um, and that the car was very heavily undersealed. Um, so yeah, really pleased with that. So the Escort passed its MOT at 18,539 miles. It was also serviced at the same time. Um, and yeah, the only issue we had with servicing was that they couldn't find the appropriate oil filter for the car. And this is a problem I'm starting to find with the car is that the registration number on the car doesn't exist on some systems. So like, for example, Dingbro, Halfords um, and Euro Car Parts are the main ones where the registration number don't doesn't seem to exist. Now I can get away with getting things like wipers um, just by using an old registration number off one of my dad's old escorts um, but apparently farmers had to actually contact um, Unipart who was the original oil filter on had to, that was the oil filter on the car to get a part number or something similar to it. So we managed to, managed to get a car back about five o'clock and it did take a wee bit longer to do the, the service trying to locate that oil uh, filter. But we've got the car back um, and we're now going to reveal its plans for 2024. So in March it'll be doing two road trips. It'll be going to Rosterville down at the British, at the British Motor Museum in Gaydon. Um, and also, I'll also be taking it down to the Practical Classics and Restoration show in a couple of weeks later. So, it's now, we're now going to get a few miles on this car. Um, not too s silly miles, but we're going to enjoy this car over 2024. Enjoy some road trips. And then, and we're now going to start tidying up the bodywork in certain places. But I just thought I'd give you a um, update on Project Escort. I've also got some little goodies coming its way, which I'll film in another video. They've actually arrived. All the goodies have arrived. Um, stuff arrived yesterday and some stuff arrived today. And I'll share that in another video on Project Escort. But focus now is to get this car tidied up a wee bit and um, give this car a, a decent wash wax and a polish and enjoy this car um, over 2024. So I'd just like to thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe at Scottish Car Enthusiasts and Trains TV and we'll catch you in a future video. Farewell.